Last time we looked at the if statement. It's a select statement. It allows us to select a piece of code. You can actually do lots of things with the if statements. You can also have things called else ifs, and hopefully later later on we'll have a look at else ifs. But sometimes you've got lots of things to choose from. And if you've got three or four or five things to choose from, then actually the if statement can become very, very messy. So a better way of doing that is this one here called the select case. Now at first case it looks a little bit, oh my god, what the hell is this thing? But actually it's not too difficult at all. It says select the case for int age. And then it gives you the cases you deal with. Case is less than 16. So if int age is less than 16, then run this code. Case 16. So if int age is exactly 16, then run this code case 17 to 2064 so if int age is a value between those two then run this bit of code same thing with 65 to 75 and here's what we call the catch-all and with select case statements you really should make sure you've always got a catch-all it doesn't matter if it doesn't do anything apart from put an error message on the screen but a catch-all to catch those few things you weren't predicting to have happen so case else and we've got one here you need that should says you need. I can't even type. So you need oh need need to renew your license annually. So oh I can't type it there either. Look at that, how useless my computer system has a bug. You need to renew your license periodically and my catch all is you need to renew your license annually. So if you're not younger than 16, 16, 1764, or basically anything from zero to 75 years old then you're going to need to renew your license now clearly someone could put minus one in and then they're going to need to re renew their license annually but I don't think many faces are going to be filling out my program so I'm not going to majorly worry about that so this select case actually isn't too confusing and you can have as many case statements as you need let's see it running I'm not going to go through every example and this is when you can't test the program out every time but let's just have a look at 15 and it is you are too young to drive. Run it again. Bring it down to there. And let's try now something between 17 and 64. Let's go to 56 just to check it, check it out. You can now drive. Fantastic. And let's put a value that doesn't appear on our list. So let's put in our 121. You need to renew your license annually. It's selecting the other lines. Every time I run it, it doesn't run those pieces of code. It simply selects the piece of code it needs to run. Another selection, a really nice selection. Select case are really nice to use. So that's it.